Hey Aries, what's cracking? What's going on Aries? So I'm here with a very quick um, spiritual message for you guys. Um, if you are interested in a personal session, I am. Um, I did update my prices. So if you haven't seen that video, I uploaded it um, a little while ago. But yeah, so let's get right into it, you guys. We have the Hex card, Banishment, Two of Cups, and the Mending and Round and Round. At the bottom of the deck, we have Invocation, Ritual. Somebody is, listen, real off the rip, somebody has tied themselves into you, okay? If it's not this actual person, then it's a higher being, somebody who structures themselves and doing things to benefit them or to benefit situations that they think they're going to work, you know, work on. Um, now, if this is not that, then this is the energy of at some point between you and another person, the words you spoke, the energy you put out there has binded you guys kind of like in a soul karmic contract, even more so than it normally would be. And so there are some things, some situations, some lessons, some deeper understanding that you and this person have to go through because the two of cups in, um, say, Gemini card, some of you guys could be dealing with a Gemini, the card of soulmates are up here. This is my strongest. I, with the nine of pentacles I just see is behind the soulmate card, the lover's card, rather, it's saying that whatever this is, it's very important for you to stick with your independence, stick with your way of doing things, because there, this person could have a way of um, contributing their energy into how you do things. So you may have a way structured in how you do things and how you move around, but this person is so hell bent on staying in your life, right? They're letting you know also that you have the power to transform any situation that you're tied into. So nothing is permanent. This is a mindset also. So you can really feel this because you can be a very strong empath, obviously. So you can feel the intentions of this person, of this situation. But like I said, it doesn't necessarily have to be this person. It could just be a, a very, some of you guys got a very strong karmic soul um, contract with this individual. So that's why you're going through because some of you guys may even be like, well, damn, why do I have to stick with this individual or why is things keep coming back? And especially with this. Now, also, let me just say with the mending card, this could be for a whole nother situation with the mending and the round and round card. This is trying to get you guys. The universe could be really the person that or not the person, but really the one who is orchestrating this because if you master and I think like I've said this in another reading before, but if you master how to enter and overstand how to heal this connection and how to really, you know, um, what's the word, y'all? Be comrades for some of you guys with this individual without it being more than what you want it to be. Then you have mastered human relationships. Some of you guys who want to go to school for psychology or human relations or whatever, this is it. This is your test. Um, what is it called when you have like um not thesis? I can't think of what it is, but that's this is what that is, okay? All right, you guys. I hope that this has been helpful in some sort of way. I love you guys. Peace.